Alright, this is gonna be interesting. Uh, hello everybody. This is in fact not me drawing. Uh, Picarto is just about drawing things, but uh, I decided to do a little bit of game streaming. I don't know how long this is gonna last, but uh, this is a game that I've been wanting to play for a very long time. And uh, I can't play this in the middle of the day. You have to play these games very, very much at night. Uh, the later the better. And uh, I'm going to see how far I, I get to fit a frame whilst I'm answering these questions. We have uh, Zeo Lighting. Void Stalker Zero, Master Yaoi, LP, Kappa Crisp, and Kurikoe. Welcome. Alright, well, mm -hmm, I think everything is rolling okay. Hopefully, my GPU doesn't just crap out on me. Let's check out the options. Okay, let me see. Oh, do, 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 do. I gotta check the chat here. Make sure the chat is being represented well here. Nope, hang on. I should have set up this a little bit better. Yes, no drawing, just me playing a little bit. In the dark, late at night. Let's let's pump that volume up, shall we? Stereo mono, no uh, no surround sound. That stinks. What is this? The olden days of gaming. And see, brightness is pretty much set fine. Uh, okay. Let's get started. Now I have played through the introduction many a times. <laughs> I wasn't trying to record, but uh, this is the first time I'm going to do it with you guys here. So let's see how that goes. Tecmo. As far as I know, there are uh, four Fatal Frame games. So sweet and kind. He was the only one I could open up to about these visions. Man, this voice acting. I've said it in a video I've done before, but man, this voice acting is terrible. It's true. It's my only family. September 24, 1986. Hey, that's where I was born, 1986. Not not in Japan, but the year. So this is Himuro Mansion. Himuro Mansion. Fatoru Frame. I think in Japan it's called Project Zero, which doesn't make any sense. Anything could be Project Zero. A freaking racing a race car game could be called Project Zero. My brother was in search of someone. Fatal Frame sounds really good, though. Jinsei Takamine. A Jinsei Takamine. And a man my brother was very indebted to. Disappeared while researching a book. So the brother is looking for a guy, and then the sister is going to be looking for the brother, and then possibly the aunt is going to go looking for the sister. That's just how the family goes. Mr. Takamine is the guy we are looking for. Apparently, he's a writer and he was doing research in this mansion. I'm not completely sure what this guy is to Mr. Takamine. Like he was going far away. Oh, be shoujo as hell. It's okay, guys, in the chat, you can you can say something. I'll, I'm paying attention to the chat. Himuro intro. Intro is not his last name. It's just Himuro. Himuro-chan. Alright, here we go. Wee. It looks like Mr. Takamine was doing research into them. 
I wonder if his group is still here. I wonder if his group is still here. Uh, I forgot six. Okay, there's something here. There's a child behind. Last time I called it a child butt. But it is, in fact, just a behind. Wait, uh, let's see that little blue thing here. Where is it? I. Uh, uh, you, uh, come on, this thing's kind of sensitive. Should I get closer? There it is. Blue. Hmm, that stinks. Alright, let's see. Uh, Alright, we got that child behind. Oh, I just wasted film. Uh, but then again, they give you film like nobody's business here, so there's no problem. So if you're not familiar with the Fatal Frame series, the idea is to capture ghosts with your camera. It's not a Canon camera or a Kodak. Kodak doesn't even exist anymore. It's a regular, old-fashioned, uh, mystical camera that sucks in their uh, their spirits or whatever. So, so I don't know why this guy has it from the get-go. But apparently he knew something was up because he showed up to a mansion with a with a Spectre camera. So when you show up to a crazy mansion with a Spectre camera, you know something's going down. Ooh, let's see. Let's check out this shiny thing here. It's a box of film. Type 14 film. I think this is either the most common type of film or the most powerful type of film. Ah, uh, yeah, the camera controls. Uh, it's not too difficult. You see, and take shooting stance. Mm -hmm. Press the okay. I like it when they give you uh, two options when clicking the button, either the X or the R1 button. While in final mode, you can control the player's viewpoint with the analog stick. Uh -huh. This is opposite to first-person shooters. You move around, you move the camera with the left analog stick, and you move the the guy around, your character around with the right analog stick. Those Japanese, they always like to do things differently. Did you know that zero, that the O in the PlayStation controller is actually means correct, and X means incorrect? That's why in most uh, American games, when you want to select something, you, you press X. And when you want to select something in a Japanese game, you have to press the O button. Maru. Alright, so this is the save point. So I need a camera in order to save my progress. It's like, there's cameras for everything. Oh, this is my old save file. Let's just save on top of that. We're not going to use that right now. Yes, if you've never uh, played Fatal Frame, it is quite interesting. And there's four of them. And I have three of them. I don't have the Wii one, though. Return to the game? Yes, let's return to the game. Let's open this door here. And the ropes. Those ropes are going to play an important role later on. You'll see. Mind my words. Ooh! Rope hallway man. I also like that random ghosts appear. Well, they're not really random, but uh, they're they are placed around the mansion, and you just ha you only have like a couple of seconds to take the pictures. Sometimes they spook you. Not me. I'm too much of a man. Let me uh, raise the volume as high as it'll go. Okay, so this door is boarded up. There's a crazy mirror. Would you put a mirror right in front of a hallway? I think that would be such bad... How is it called? Uh, feng Shui. Also, it's creepy as hell. I mean, <laughs> don't put mirrors in front of hallways, man. That's just, that's just wrong. Alright. This is a very old, old house, so I have no idea how any of this stuff works. There's a whole bunch of other relics here. There's an old lion mask, many other antiques too. Collecting was the owner's hobby. Huh? And a bunch of samurai armor around here, and an old drawer. Here's where they cook their meats or their fish. And a, and a separator of some kind. Oh god! Bam! Headshot! Yeah, you don't scare me, Mr. Ghost. All books, they're about dark rituals. They belong to the man that lived here. Who else are they going to belong to? Okay, the books are falling apart. I can't even read the covers. Well, it's pretty old. Uh, okay, so whenever that little blue thing on the right flashes, that means there's something ghostly appearing. And i got to look for it. And if I'm not right... Ooh, there it is. Wait, what is it? What is it? Hangry Man. 
Okay. I collected an angry man. They're like Pokemans. These ghosts are like Pokemans. You gotta collect them all. There's an old clock here. I've been stopped for a... It's been stopped for a while, and there are cobwebs. Well, let's just leave it alone. It's not a good idea. Uh, let's continue. The Adventures of Himura? Himura. That's a little shiny thing here. I've already seen this thing many times, so I'm gonna check out some stuff. Mr. Takamines. Oh, the thousand hands groping your butt. I guess that's really scary, I guess. Okay, now we get our first encounter with an evil spirit. I don't know about you, but if I started hearing weird noises in the middle of the night, I wouldn't be quiet. I'd be like, just screaming at the top of my lungs. <laughs> just going ape shit. Just oh yeah. Like the ghost ain't gonna know what to do in that situation. Like what the hell's up with this guy? Oh god. So every ghost has a, a background story. At least they try to incorporate that into the story. I don't know what this guy's deal is though. So it's kind of difficult. We hold up the camera. Ah, basically just telling you, hold up the camera, wait for it to turn red, and when it turns red, you get the extra shot. The super shot. Yes. Let's let's get into there. Let's go. Come at me, bro. Okay, you gotta wait until you get the perfect shot. Come on. Yeah, come on. Come on, let's get a little closer. Oh, he disappeared. Bam! Headshot. Now this guy is a pushover. Later on, you're gonna meet some really crazy ghosts. And if you don't know what he's saying, he's saying, "Help me! I'm helping you, dude. I'm helping you get the hell away from me." There you go. Zero shot. Perfect shot. And that's it. I captured a ghost. I captured a ghost. I captured a ghost with this camera. This camera has the power to expose things the normal eye can't see. Really? I remember the incident from which I learned of its unique power to capture ghosts. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, I can't capture him. There isn't anything in the drawers of chests. This case has fallen down. Probably been doing a while. What? Been down a while, nothing to do with Takamine. Not not everything has to do with Mr. Takamine, alright? Why don't you just marry him if you're so interested in... Let's go. By the way, I am playing this on an emulator because I have no other way to capture footage. So, I have a PS2. I have four PS2s. Uh, two of them died. One of them is slim. And then I haven't used... And the other one I kind of lost. Uh, take care of your things, kids. The door to the entrance is open, but I'm sure it was just closed a while ago. Well, let's go check it out then. Maybe, maybe the other door is open. Nope, it's not open. Let's just get out of here. Uh, all right, we we've seen enough. We don't know where Mr. Takamura is. Let's just get the hell out of here. Takamine, I'm sorry. Yeah, capture cards aren't extremely difficult to get. Ah, my eyes! 
<laughs> oh, that actually hurt. It's been two weeks since I last heard from my brother. Okay, now the real story starts. In Fatal Frame, you always play as some helpless 13-year-old uh, chick. But she's not really helpless because she survives the entire thing. And she gets the camera. This is what I don't understand, okay? This girl is looking for her lost brother, and she knows it's gonna be in some crazy rundown mansion. So, what does she do? She puts on her boots, the shortest skirt she can find, and a slee and a silk freaking blouse. Puts on all her makeup, and does her hair. Why? I don't get that. You're looking for your brother in a rundown, crappy. Possibly hunted location, and you get dressed like you're going to a freaking disco. <sighs> All the girls want help. All the girls want help, but they don't know what exactly they want. They're never sure. All right, let's go into adventure. It's like, really? Why is she dressed like this? She should be wearing freaking overalls and just covered in. In a, in a big thick leather coat or something like that. I mean, I'm asking why she's dressed like this, but I know exactly why she's dressed like this. I know exactly why, and I think you do too. Ah, right, but actually the game has color, if you didn't know. Because uh, the game, the part that we were playing was actually a... a memory. A flashback. And now we're in the real game. Let's check out. Herbal medicine. Uh, basically, they are the herbs. From Resident Evil, basically. Let's go in through here for no apparent reason. And let us save our game. Hello, Art of Yordan. The game that you are seeing in front of your eyeballs is called Fatal Frame. Alright, yes. It is a horror game. Not a very scary horror game, but it's still a horror game nonetheless. I have the audio s turned all the way up as much as my brain can take without going deaf, but it's a good volume. Ooh, let's, let's check this out. Remember when I said that the robes paid played some kind of role into the game? Well, we'll see. Let's check out the research notes. I'm guessing it was left over by the other guy. Now there's another rope. And another rope. Okay. Yep, these ropes are quite important. I'm not completely sure why, but they are important. Cutscene. There you go, the brother left the camera on the floor. There might be a bondage scene, I'm not completely sure. Ah, uh, playing games and then the white light is not good. Ah, uh, my goodies! Grabbing my goodies. Uh, okay, so apparently she has the power to read memories from objects. That is a horrible thing to have. Ghosts love appearing behind you. They pick up. You picked up my. Bro I picked up my brother's camera and an upload from the floor. My old mom's old camera, my brother had this with him. 
Found a new book in Let's check it out. Mafuyu's Himuro Mansion investigation. Himuro Mansion was once the home of a large landowner that controlled vast areas of land. They also say that the site held some special significance that had to do with the Shinto rituals of the region. I don't know what Shinto rituals are, but it has it's scary stuff. I couldn't find any detailed books about these Shinto rituals, though. Me neither. The last master of the Himuro family line massacred his entire household. Later, another family that tried to live there disappeared. Because of incidents like these, nobody visits the mansion today, and it lies in ruins. Maybe that's why there aren't any accounts of the Shinto rituals, and why the exact location of this place isn't recorded anywhere. And September 24th, I've had a bad feeling ever since I came to this mansion. I'm leaving notes in this notebook just in case anything happens to me. I've got to find Mr. Takamine and the others fast. I hope it's not too late. Okay, stays lost. There we go. Man on a beam. He seems very relaxed. I don't know about you, but that doesn't seem like that many ropes. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, they're hiding over there. That doesn't seem like that many ropes. It's not that impressive. Come on. That's not a very impressive rope collection, if you ask me. But let's, let's see what else we got. I love this reflection. I love games that give you reflections like this. If you played Silent Hill 3, there is a room with a reflection window sort of thing. It is the scariest room in the entire game. It creeped the hell out of me. And I don't get creeped out all that often. But it was really good. Let's see. Alright, so we're just backtracking basically. Oop, there's something shiny. There's a lion mask on the chest of drawers. There's a medicine container near the ornamental lion mask. Do you think the herbal medicine would be more important to mention than the mask? Can I do anything with the mask? There are lots of antiques here and in poor repair. The owner's hobby, maybe. Maybe they're they're valuable. You can sell that on Craigslist. I'm sure people in Craigslist would pay high price for haunted objects. There are crazy people like that. Ooh, here we go. I believe this is my brother. Bro's shadow. <laughs> I don't know about you, but you call yourself bro when you saw the ghost of your brother. Doesn't it kind of takes away some of the severity of the situation? Let's see, I faded away. Okay, let's go up. Oh wait, no, let's check out this place again. Yeah, I wonder if she says it. Wait, did she say something different? Old books there about dark rituals. The man, says she, she has the exact same mind thought as her brother. It's a box of film in front of suitcases. There we go. Out. The clock stopped at 11:45. It's been stopped for a while. There are cobwebs. Eh, about the same. All right. So from here on, I'm not completely sure what's going on. So your guess is as good as mine. If you have played the game, then you know exactly what's going on. So let's just see here. Okay. So there's a locked door up here. I'm hearing chanting. Some sort of crazy chanting. Yeah, she does move funny. She walk. She runs like, like a girl. There's some serious chanting going on in the background. I wish this thing had some sort of uh, surround sound thing. Probably could pinpoint the thing a little bit better. I think I have a map. Let's see. There's something on the floor. Herbal medicine. That's good. Let's see. Uh, where's my map? Nope, that's not the map. Boop, boop. There we go, okay. Let's zoom in here. Okay, that's one door up here. It's kind of locked. Chanting's getting a little stronger. Wait, is this a door? I hate these walls where you can't tell what one's a door and what isn't. Yes, yes, I was locked. Alright, let's just go down, I guess. Oh. This guy is lost. He's so lost. Yes, I realize Picarto is not for video games, but I want to stream some video games and possibly put this on my YouTube. Because why not? Oh! 
Stranger danger, the opposite. Stay away from me, child. Go away, go bother somebody else. <gasps> the camera. What? What about the camera? Okay, the camera and pointing to the door. Okay. No, you should just stay there and not do a single thing. The camera is meant to take photos. Just take the damn photos. Let's see. Uh, in finer mode, you can see things that can't be seen with a naked eye. Try taking a photo in the control if the control vibrates. I don't have vibrate on an emulator, so that's going to suck. Or you hear strange noises. Well, that's something. Or you could just look at this wavy stuff going on here. Take a picture of that. No folding screen door. A, do a door appears where the screen should be. I don't think this was necessary. You could have just moved it a little bit, and you would have seen there was a door there. Hmm. It couldn't possibly be that heavy. <gasps> just like the photo, there was actually a door there. All right, there seems to be a hidden door behind the folding. Screen. Okay, let's open it. Let's investigate it. Oh, we got a we got a navy here. Let's go touch it. Let's touch the navy. A key to what? This is exactly. Ooh, can I move these things? Yes, I can. Wow, physics on the PlayStation 2 era. That's impressive. Is this door? Nah, everything looks like doors to me. Let's just keep going. Okay, there's a door here. Yes. No, the controller is not battery operated. As far as I know. Let's check out this shiny thing. There's a small piece of paper on the chest. It looks like a news clipping. Let's check out this news clipping. Late yesterday, a human body with no limbs was found in Humuro Mountain, located in the southern region of the prefecture. <laughs> the Japanese love their prefectures. Uh, the body's hands, feet, and head were all torn off. Mm -hmm. The police is investigating the case as both a murder and accident. I guess it could be both things. Mm. The body has not been identified, but it is believed to be a man around the age of 30. The police is also taking into consideration the fact that a body mutilated in the same manner was found in the same location 15 years ago. Well, there might be a connection there. Oh! What? No, no, no. I got you. A woman in a kimono is coming. I hear these strange noises. Join us! Join us! Let's open up that door where that crazy sound was coming from. Ah, it's a tape recorder. Oh, okay. Oh, I missed it! Oh no! No! That's what I get for looking for the chat. I missed it. Well, let's go. There isn't anybody in the closet. But there's something there. Huh? What? Oh, that's no fair. That's that's too timing. Come on. All right. So he was scared. He hid in a closet, I guess. Dude, don't hide in a closet. Just. Bust through a window or something. Japanese houses' walls are made of paper anyway. Ooh, there's somebody in there. Long haired Japanese ghost woman. Ah, my goodies. <laughs> She's always after my sugar lumps. All the ghosts want my sugar lumps. I found a tape recorder in the closet. It's covered with dust, but it seems to work. The audio tape has been left inside the recorder. I stopped in the middle. I can, I can listen to audios, I believe. Let's see, yes, playing. Let's have a listen. September 9th, 
5.40 p.m. The mansion was nowhere to be seen on the map, so we finally had to ask the locals how to find it. They told us that Himuro Mansion had been empty for several decades now. The same ones who told us where it was also warned us not to come here, which was quite disconcerting. I like it how this guy is taking notes, basically taking notes on a tape recorder, and he's so careful in making sure he enunciates every single word perfectly. You know? I don't do that ever. I don't do that while I'm streaming, as you guys can tell. The voice acting just kind of stinks. I guess if this was in Japanese, well, the voice acting was in Japanese, I'd get a little bit more into it, but then I had to do a whole lot more reading, and uh, I'm not ready for reading in a video game just yet. Alright, let's continue. Ah, uh, let's see, I think there was a ghost going through here, through these kimonos. Now this one is a kind of a creepy room, really. Because you got all these, like, bloody kimonos. I'm not sure they're bloody. Oh! They're not bloody, they just have patterns. But eh, it looks kind of creepy, I guess. An old kimono chest. Small mirror stand. Uh, ooh, I wonder if it's like a key. Oop, you got something. Where is it? Come on. Is it here? Oh, found it. Woman in kimono. Do I get points or experience points or something? That'd be nice. Stop coming from behind. Think of something else, ghosts. Come on. They keep wanting help, and they keep trying to kill me while trying to get help. Bam! Head the shot. Screw you, bro. You got nothing. One shot and you're dead, man. Come on. The camera began to glow with mystical power. The camera sealed. Oh, oh yeah, we got power ups at this in this game. You can acquire mystical power by damaging ghosts. Select camera from the menu mm -hmm. to access the power up screen. You can unlock the seal on the camera with the accumulated mystical power and power up. Auxiliary functions. When you unlock auxiliary function seals, you enable many special attacks to use the enable auxiliary function. Press the L1 button while in a shooting stance. The number of auxiliary functions you can see is limited to, to the number of spirit stones in your inventory. Okay, so spirit stones are my ammunition. Uh, L1 is my special ability that I can use with my camera, and I can level up my camera. Why not? Okay, let me see. Let's pick this up, shall we? There's something underneath the window. Ooh, another tape. Let us check the camera and see if we can level it up. Basic performance, bonus function, special function, bonus function, special function. Okay. Let's see. Okay, what do we need here? Um, increase the maximum charge value of mystical power. Speeds up charge time for mystical power and widens the capture circle. I think I'm gonna go with the wider angle because getting those ghosts on the in the, on the circle gets a little more difficult as the game goes on and uh, as long as you keep the circle the circle where the ghosts are you're gonna hit them and you're gonna do a lot of damage so we'll do that we'll make that as easy as possible bam 
Okay, so now the next improvement is gonna be what? Twelve thousand I was gonna say dollars, twelve thousand points. Alright. Let's see. Pressure pushes goats back, slows us. Uh, let's see. Slow, see, make it goes visible, paralyze, and search. Locations of ghosts and tracks them automatically. Hmm. I think I used up all my points. Yep. Uh, I think these functions, they require ammo, so the first thing you gotta do is level up the basic performance because that requires no ammunition. You just keep using the camera like normal. And bonus functions, you gotta use ammunitions and sometimes you're not gonna have them. So, and they're only for very specific situations. So I'm not really gonna use the bonus functions as much. I'm gonna just rely on my own awesome accuracy. It's all good. And special function. Hmm, this game is farting to me. That's not very mature, Tecmo. Let's let's get out of here. Uh, I think that was about it. Nothing here. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Something shows in the photo. It looks like the lion mask near the sunken fireplace. Ah, yeah. I remember where that was. Let's go back to it. Put the photo in my files. Did I miss this thing or is this new? I think I missed it. Well, let's follow where that uh, photo told me to go. Hello, Linkios. I am playing Fatal Frame for the PlayStation 2, also known as Project Zero. What's with the crazy noises? I thought I picked up that tape. Maybe there's something else. Ooh. Film, I am. Okay. I guess that the tape recorder never stops. That's gonna get annoying. <gasps> We're being attacked from behind, as always. Oh, let's go. Let's go, buddy. Let's go, buddy. Wah! Come at me, bros. Ah, no, I pressed the wrong button. Yeah, come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Oh, no. Headshot. These ghosts are pussies. Hey, it's the same guy! It's the same guy that I just defeated. I guess I don't collect their souls. What the hell? Man, this camera is, is a jip. I thought I was capturing their ghosts. Okay, so we're back to where that picture told me to go back. Oh, there's fish! Oh man, that fish must be stankin'. Wait, is that fish? What is that? What the heck is that? Is that a blob of mer mercury? That must be part of the pot or something, huh? Man, those textures are horrible. Let's check out. Ah, uh, antiques, yep. There's something reflecting light from inside the ornament light mask. A red hand mirror. Okay, so I think I know where to go now, I guess. A whole lot of backtracking. Nope. Oh. Man in closet. <laughs> uh, is he gonna get out of the closet? Who knows? He might stay in the closet his entire life. He'll be very disappointed, and his family, they'll never know that he was in the closet. The punchline is that he's gay. I don't know if you got that. He's probably not gay. Who cares if he's gay? Whatever. Let's play the game. Nothing. You know what would have been scarier than nothing? 
anything. He lied to me. He said there's something in there and there's nothing in there. You lying bastard. What the hell, man? Okay, there's something on the floor. Herbal medicine. Maybe I didn't look hard enough. Let's let's see. There was nothing in there, you lying sack of bastard. Really? Really, guys? Is that the best you got? Come on. Ah, that drawer. Let's go back to where all the kim the pretty kimonos were. It was here, right? Open the door. Open the door! What the hell? Ah. Okay, it was that one. Let's do it! Yes, put the red hand mirror in there. Let's let's go. Let's see what you got. A picture and a key. Who took that picture and how did they put it in that drawer? Of the man who was attacking me, the ghost of the man who was attacking me. I just saw. The ropes. He's got ropes on his neck. I can see the faint shadow of ropes on the man's neck, arms and legs. Ooh. Interesting. I got a small key from the drawer. Brass key. I wonder if it's a key to some door. Really? <laughs> I guess it could be a key to a lock. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Whoa, personal space, buddy. Come on, man. Jeez. Oh, you got another guy. He wants another round. Let's go. Come at me. Come on. Come on. You keep trying and you keep failing, man. Let's go. Okay, see now he's not saying help me, help me. He's just he's just after my sugar lumps, that's all. Where is he though? I hear him here, like the stereo is helping me find him. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Ooh uh, three zero shot. -to. This game can't even handle me right now. Is he dead yet? Come on. Uh, that's enough of this guy. There's something shiny where the ghosts once stood. Okay. This mysterious stone enhances the camera's power and enables auxiliary functions. Sweet. Oh, wait a minute. Spirit stone? A uh, stone with hidden powers enables the camera's focus. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, those are the stones that we use in order to use the uh, special abilities that the camera has. I think you have to press L1 in order to uh, activate them. It's They're ammo, basically. I don't think I want to use them as much. Mostly because I don't have any special abilities selected, so... We're not going to do that. Let's just continue. I have no idea where I'm going. Was there a locked door? I don't remember. Ah, I think the tape recorder finally stopped. Let's check it out. Nobody's in the closet. Was there a thing here? Oh, let me see. What button was it? Okay, let's see. Um, okay, so this is the kimono room. That's where I came out of. Yeah, uh -huh. uh, This door seems to be locked, I suppose. That door is boarded up. Maybe it's on the other side. Ah! Ah! It's the locked door from the other one. Okay, I remember. There's a locked door on the second floor where the where the brother found the notebook. I gotta pay attention.
Let's go. And I have not saved my game, so if my computer crashes right now, I'm screwed. Yeah, that's where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, they like to do that. Should I go back? I'm going back. I'm going to save my game. If it lets me. The ropes. The ropes. I'm saving my game, man. I'm too scared. Let's see. Okay. At the very least, this game does not require any kind of like uh, ink or anything like that in order to save. You can save as many times as you want, as often as you want. That's perfectly fine with me. Saving, and we are saved. Thank you. 38 minutes. Not bad. How's everybody doing? Uh, Linkios, LP, Meow Guy, Art of, Art of Yurudan, Mr. Yaoi, Vault Stalker Zero, and Kuri Koe. Thank you for uh, for being on the stream. Hope you're enjoying me flay around this evil mansion for your amusement. Let me just uh, let me just check. This here, link here. Okay, I guess we're doing fine. All right, back to the game. Okay, so now we gotta go and open the door that is on the second floor. Let's go up these tier tails. Hope no ghosts speak under my skirt. Really, girl, just don't wear a skirt, for God's sakes, when you're going spelunking in a in a haunted mansion. Just wear some pants, for God's sakes. It's okay. You can wear some sweatpants. No one's going to judge you. There is a black padlock on the door. Let us open this. This be up. What lies inside? Let us check out. Oop. Let's see here. There is no book written in the charcoal ink on the shelf under the, the urn. Secret rituals of the Himuro family. Many rituals and customs have been passed down through generations of the Himuro family. Most of them are lost. The only things we have left now are some documents that record these rituals as a legend. Hardly any of the oral history remains. This is because all Himuro family members are dead, and those who are close to the family have kept quiet about the ritual, or else. One ritual in particular, performed on December 13th, is shrouded in mystery. People who lived near the mansion stayed inside on that particular day, and even now it is considered bad luck to leave the windows open on that day. I can only assume that this is due to the cruel nature of this ritual, but the truth remains unknown. I'm pretty sure it has everything to do with that cruel ritual. I guess ghosts could be uh, pretty judgmental. But I mean, if if all you're doing is trying to look for your brother, then screw them. Go off on your own thing, girlfriend. Wait, I'm trying to get that little shiny thing in the back. Let's go. Herbal medicine. I have not used any herbal medicine because I have not been attacked. Let's check this layout of the land. Uh, okay, let's see here. Um, I think we're going to take this door. Because it looks like it's going to lead to a smaller room, and I don't want to explore bigger rooms just now. Ooh. I was wrong, I guess. That's a closet, okay. Let's see. A roll of film. Type 37 film. This film is, I think, is much more powerful than the regular film. Got it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No. Your womanly instincts? I guess. So this is the other girl that was part of the group. If you guys are just tuning in, I'm looking for Mr. Takamura. No. My brother, 
her brother, was looking for Mr. Takamura. Takamura was with two other people. The guy I just killed and this chick. So... My journey is to look for my brother, but my brother was looking for these three guy people. So now I gotta go look for everybody. <sighs> there are several pieces of paper on the floor. Looks like a notebook. Okay, red notebook. I'm pretty sure it's from a girl. Let's check it out. The more I find out about Himura Mansion, the creepier it gets. I'm sure it's the perfect subject matter for Mr. Takamine's next book, but to be perfectly honest, I don't like this assignment one bit. It gives me a bad feeling. There's no way I want to go to the mansion, but it's my job, right? I guess I'll have to go, and I wouldn't want to waste the chance to work with Mr. Takamine just because of a little bit of uneasiness, either. It doesn't help I have this sixth sense for the supernatural, either. Stop saying either. There's such a thing as knowing too much, sometimes. Alright. Okay, we're not going down those creepy stairs just yet. What's in here? Nothing. Yep, shiny. Pick up the shiny thing. Herbal medicine. Oh man, people just leave this stuff lying around, don't they? Door is stuck fast. Try pulling in, but it wouldn't budge. But is it like I? It's impossible to open, or is it ever gonna open? I don't. Know. Let's see. Okay, before I go down there, let us explore the other doors. Let's see, there's a door here. Let's see what we got. Ah, the big door was a balcony. I thought it was a bigger place. Okay. Oh, there's somebody there. And I missed him. And there's nothing here. Oh, wait, is that shiny? Yeah, 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 there's something shiny here. Okay, let's go check it out. More herbal medicine. Well, I guess it's good to stock up. Too bad there's no, uh, there's no seller, you know, the stranger, stranger. I've got a good weapon, I've got a good selection of... I completely screwed that up. I for, I completely forgot what he says. Um, I'll remember it eventually, and I'll bore you with the details later. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. If we had one of those guys, the merchants, I could sell all my excess stuff. Hmm. Ah, I was already here. Let's go back. Yep, boring details are the best. Wait, there was sh something shiny under this table. I could have sworn there was something shiny here. Wait, right, let's go back. I know there was something shiny down there. Let's... <sighs> I really don't want to. No. Oh, the door closes automatically. Let's check it out. Right? Yeah. See, see, see. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. There's something in there. How are you supposed to get that? Is that under the table? What's going on here? It's a sturdy-looking old desk. Okay, just reach under there and grab that thing that's in there. <gasps> there it is! A beautiful stone. Okay, so we got some more ammo. Uh, let's see, there's this door here. Let's check out this door. <gasps> A save slot. Let's go check it out. Yes, let us save. Okay, let's get out of here. There's some breathing. There's an audio tape in front of the door. Oh yeah, I didn't listen to the other audio tape. I guess we'll we'll listen to it right now. There are several pieces of paper on the shelf. They look like part of a red notebook. Okay, so this is the notebook of the girl, I imagine, because she's wearing a red jacket and this thing's red, so might as well be. It seems a fork of folklorist named Ryozo Manakata was studying about the various rituals passed down in Himuro Mansion. He supposedly left a book of research, but I can't find it anywhere. I wonder if there's a copy in a library somewhere. Hmm. I still can't find the book. I'll have Koji Ogata. I think Koji is the guy... No. No, I think that's a different guy. 
I thought it was the ghost that was haunting me, the male ghost. From the editing department, do a research, do a search for it. I doubt he'll be able to find it though. Well, that was useless. He didn't give me any more details of anything. There's something inside the drawer. Ooh. It pays to look for stuff. There's a small door here, but it's nailed shut. Can't open it. All right. These creepy ass dolls. Who here has a fear of dolls? I know I don't, but I still wouldn't want them looking at me while I'm sleeping. I'll just save since I've collected some stuff. Well, that's a good thing. Let's go. All right, so we explored every other place. I guess the only place to go is down the stairs, down those creepy ass stairs. Was it here? Let me see. Yes, that's here. Okay. Come on, tank controls, behave. Let's see. It's here. No, that was just the closet. All right, let's go. Well, this goes down the stairs. Ah, uh, there we go. Cutscene. Is that the brother? Yeah, that's the brother. His Bishojo shadow just shows everywhere. Mafuyu. Uh, wait. Ah, wait. Uh, 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 wait. <laughs> Run! That's a different shadow. Hello, stranger. Oh, crap. This thing can move. Oh, yeah. Hang on. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, crap. Oh. Yeah, screw you, dog. Let's go. Let's go. Come at me. Come at me. You think you're so tough? Let's go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What up? What up? What up? What up? I figured out you you duck when you're gonna attack. What you want, man? What you want? I could do that. But people have to pay me. A lot more money. Alright, so that was the big badass ghost of the below the stairs. Another red notebook. September 10th, 8 p.m. I clearly saw the image of a woman in front of a mirror near the entrance. She had long hair and a white kimono. There were ropes tied to her arms and legs, and she dragged them along when she walked. I think I heard Koji talk about something like that, too. There's something very wrong about this mansion. So wrong that she felt to write it on her little notebook. Uh, there's a dark red stain as a blood had flown there. It's not blood, it's ketchup. Everybody knows that. Oh man, that's a lot of partitions, is that what it's called? Ah, this is getting ridiculous. It's <laughs> opening a door to another door to another door. <coughs> that's kind of annoying. Ooh, shiny. Some blue film, which I have not used at all. Ooh, this room looks creepier. I like the lighting in this game. Look at those shadows. Look at them shadows. That's some good shadows. Some P good PS2 shadows. Sacred water. Holy water. Is it holy water? I don't know what that is. Let's see. Nope, that's not it. I, I want to look at my items. Items. Let's check it out. 
Uh, sacred water. Water from sacred mountain springs. It fully restores your health. Oh, okay, so it's it's basically a uh, a first aid spray. There's something wrapped around the hair. It won't move. It looks like hair. <gasps> what is it with the Japanese and using hair to scare people? I don't think hair is scary. It's gross. It's not scary. Then his nails shut from the outside. I can't look outside. Okay, pick up this thing. Research scrap. The Mystery of the Rope Maiden. Among the few documents found on the ritual, mention of the rope's shrine maiden is made many times. Her arms, legs, and neck are bound by five ropes. However, no documents discuss the role she plays in the ritual. The theory is that she is a sacrificial lamb, but I find it hard to believe that such a cruel ritual was practiced. We've done worse. Have you seen the Aztecs and what they did to the prisoners? They've skinned them and then dressed in their skin and then paraded around for like a week until the skin rotted off. It's true. Look it up. Oh god, they made a, a horror game about the Aztecs and their crazy ass rituals? That would be so badass. I was going to look at my my uh, my map. Uh, that door is closed, so I got to go all the way around. All right. Oh shit! Oh crap! First one. Finally got hurt. Let's see. Where you at? Where you at? Oh yeah! Oh, yeah. Come on! Come at me! Come at me! That's no fair, this this ghost caught me off guard. The ghost was supposed to tell me before they attacked me, come on. Hello Bear Supremacy, yes we are playing uh, Fatal Frame for the PS2 on an emulator. <laughs> that wasn't so bad, you weren't so tough. Let's see, camera. Can I increase my performance? Yes I can, performance enhancers. Let's go. One more for the range. I need that range. The range is super important. Glad you like it, Bear Supremacy. I'm going to play for as long as I can, and uh, hopefully you guys stick with me to the very end. No, it's, <laughs> I don't know, maybe another hour or less than that. You know? I don't want to do the entire thing today. Let's see, should I spend on another one? Nah, I'm going to wait until my range is super, super high. It's better to have one thing super powerful and than having a, uh, an ability that's halfway done. You know, if you have one thing that's super powerful, then at the very least you can rely on that. Let's see, where am I going? Okay, there's a door here. Let's check out that door. Oh, wait, are these hands prints? All the walls are painted with blood. Maybe the ghost with the long arms did it. Ghosts can't paint walls, okay? Their hands go through walls. It would have to be real people that did that. Oh god, a, a puzzle. There are buttons with characters. This device must open the door. door. There's an engraving underneath, the, but it's gouged. Can only be read some. I just, can just barely make up. The Shinto ritual strangling and held on the day of from the gouged outwards. Oh wait. Gouge outwards. I'm just pressing random stuff. Nothing happens. Just like I entered the wrong numbers. Okay, so these are numbers? Okay, hang on a minute. Okay, these are numbers. Please don't make me read Chinese. Don't be that cruel game. Come on, okay? Don't, I don't need to learn an entire new language in order to get past the puzzle, alright? Don't make me use game facts on you. Okay, there's a door here. Let's check out this door. Oh! We got a friendly ghost here, I think. Where, 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 where? Some more film. Mm. 
See, strangling ritual. On the 13th day... Ah, this is the information I need. Okay, hang on. On the 13th day of the 12th month, a maiden cut off from the outside world for 3669 long days. That's that's more than two years, I think. For two years? Like maybe three years. I wow. That's a lot that's a long fucking time. Alright. Shall be torn apart to provide power to the rope. Okay, so thirteen, twelve, three, six, six, nine. Five. Yeah, how many days are there in a year? Three hundred and sixty something days. Uh, the the emulator that I'm using is what's called PX PX. I forgot. I'll tell you later. <laughs> I gotta check some things though. Let's see. This is like a good time as any to check something out. It's a pretty uh, common PS2 emulator. I think if you just uh, look for it on uh, Google, it's one of the most popular ones. I'm not using anything special about it. It's just uh, the PS2 emulator. There are several pieces of paper on the shelf. They look part of red. Notebook. Okay, so let's check again. 6:30 a.m. I saw that woman in the white kimono again. She's trying to tell me something. She knows I have this special sense for ghostly things. The woman's name is Kitty. So it's Kitty, huh? Do you really write the way you speak? I don't think, I don't think I would ever write the words "huh" or "uh" or mm, when I'm taking notes. I don't know. I shouldn't get any closer than this. I don't want to get any closer. I'm, sc I'm screwed, you guys. I'm screwed. Put the piece of paper on the floor. Okay. Oh, what? There's a box for a mortuary table, T tablet, and bone remains among the candles. The owners. This is all very Japanese. I don't understand it all myself. Let's see if something shiny on some. Oh, okay, I'm yeah, yeah, not using it really, but let's go. Some other place shows in the photo. Wonder if there's something there. Okay, a bunch of crazy drawers. All right. Oh yeah, we haven't listened to the. Uh, to the tape recordings. Okay, we already listened to that. Let's listen to the white number two. September 9th, 9.40 p.m. We are playing Fatal Frame for the PS2 on an emulator. ...through the mountain at night, so we decided to spend the night here and continue... I'm hearing other voices uh, aside from him. several rooms already. Unlike the exterior, the interior is still in quite good shape. A little earlier, I thought I saw a white, shadowy figure of a woman in the hallway near the entrance. I'll keep track of such sightings and publish them in a later account. Okay. So the white, this white woman keeps appearing. Check out the red tape. I guess it's from the girl. September 10th. Yep, it's from the girl. We discovered some disturbing photos in a chest of drawers. Could these be the folklorist's children mentioned in Koji's notes? The photo is quite old and shows pictures of children. Tag. Okay. In the corner of the photo, there's a faint image of a young girl in a white kimono. Her finger is pointed this way, and her eyes look as if she's making some silent accusation. Okay, so there's two ghosts, if you're trying to keep track. There's the the, the girl with the tons of hands, Elfin Laid, basically, is attacking me. And, uh, and then there's the little girl ghost that's been pointing at things. So, let's see how that turns out.
I guess we'll open that door. Let's check out this door. Oh, save, save, save. I gotta save. Something on the floor. Herbal medicine. That is good. No, I have not, Mr. Yaoi. Oh, I heard somebody. Somebody said somebody. A black notebook. Now, nah, this is metal. Let's check it out. September 13, 1930. We found Ogata's body. His head, hands, and feet were strangled off. What happened to him is just like the strange deaths that occurred here long ago. There was a photo of Ogata near him. In it, there was something that looked like ropes on his neck and legs. Okay, so we, now we know what's going on with the bodies. I wonder if it has anything to do with the rope shrine maidens. In the legend around here, the girls that had ropes tied to their necks, arms, and legs too. Tomoe is acting strangely. She's been mumbling nonsense all morning. She eats coffee or something. Something's about ropes and mirrors. I can't blame her for going to pieces, though, after seeing what happened to Ogata. More reading. Okay. Give thanks to the five gods' protection. Place the stone representing the five mirrors in the correct location. So it's a puzzle. Ah, great. Door is closed fast. How how can a door be closed fast? Quickly, no? <laughs> I don't know. Himura's family crest. It probably unlocks the door, but it's broken. Okay, nothing to see here, I guess. Let's get the F out of here, then. I guess you could slam the door but to close it fast, but nobody slammed it. Look at those shadows. Those are some good shadows right there. Look at that. That's some good stuff. Good, good stuff. Okay, so uh, I'm supposed to go to another thing? I'm supposed to go to uh, that photograph that told me to go somewhere. So I'm supposed to solve this riddle, I guess? Let's solve this riddle. It's not really a riddle, it's more of a puzzle. Hmm. Was it here? Yeah, it was here. The Shinto ritual strangling and hell of the day of. I still don't understand these things though. Okay, I'm not gonna storm on, strong arm my way through that. That's okay, tree. This game ain't that scary. <laughs> it's, it's okay. Okay, so that's the door I'm supposed to open with the picture I took. I'm guessing whatever I need to do to open this door is in this door. So I need to look at my files. Notebooks, scraps, with scraps, five stones, documents, that's not important. That's the that's the place I need to go to. So my full use notebook, black notebook, black notebook. Did it have a specific thing? Oh god. Let's see. No, I'm pretty sure it was the scraps. Not not notebook. Five stones. Ah, the strangling ritual. 13, 12, 3, 6, 6, 9. 13, 12, 6, 6, 3, 6, 6, 9. Okay, so how do I put that in here? There are buttons with characters. This device must open the door. There's Engraving underneath, but it's gouged out, can only read some. 
I can just barely make out the Shinto ritual, the strangling, and held on the day of. Oh, for God's sakes. Okay, 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 hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So one of them is zero, I guess. I really hope I'm not thinking, overthinking it. Okay. Uh, let's just try something stupid. That's three. I'm guessing that's three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. And then six, seven, eight, nine. Nothing happened. Oh, okay. Gonna need some help, guys. I'm gonna need some help. If anybody knows what's going on, please let me know. Okay, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, so 13 is the day, 12 is the month. Okay, so 366 is not the time, it's the day and the month, 13, 12. Okay. Twelve is the day. No, thirteen is the day. Twelve is the month of the ritual. The Shinto ritual, strangling and held on the day. So twelve thirteen. Twelve. Thirteen. Nope. Thirteen twelve, yes. You're right, you're right, you're right. Thirteen twelve. Oh god. Thirteen twelve. Hmm. Counterclockwise, so it's one, two, three. Thirteen twelve. There you go, it's open! Nope! You know, you could have been a lot more useful if you actually told me what those numbers were. There doesn't seem to be anything in the drawers of the chest. You know, corner of the room and some old sort of armor. All right. Ooh, found some some extra film. That's that's good, I guess. The cabinet seems to be old and very small items. Get the scrap from here. Very small items. Probable medicine. Let's go up. Ah, tree use uh, Google. Well, thank you anyway. I still feel very smart for doing it, but uh, it was all thanks to you guys. There's an old book at the back of the drawer. Research. The disaster called Calamity. Long ago, great tragedy struck this region. One legend calls this event the Calamity, but it reveals no details regarding the disaster which unfolded. Great. 
A brief description of the event is as follows. The mirrors kept in the fine shrines broke and the dead returned from hell. I wonder what sort of disaster it must have been, because the passage can't be literal. Sure it can, why not? That was something was rummaging around. Oop, more spirit stones that I'm not really gonna use right now. Oh yeah, take your time. You don't wanna fall and break your neck. Was that it? Oh. Seductress. A strong ghostly sense has disappeared. Sweet. They're just behind the stairs too, but boxes are in the way. I can't get in. Oh no, not boxes. Not random boxes that are about waist high. That's impossible for a girl like me to get over. With, with my short skirt and everything. Okay, easy there, music. You can you can just calm down for a little bit. Let's see. All right, now we can go back to this thing here. Is it, uh, yes, it was. I like this this way of running. You press the square button. And the character just moves forward. You don't have to like press uh, forward with the analog stick or anything. And that's I really like that way because because you're pressing the analog stick a lot and just holding down the button to run forward is a great idea. More games should do that. More exploring games should do that. Okay, <clears throat> open the door. No more talisman. The force that was holding the door shut is gone. Oh no, somebody spilled their ketchup. Okay, nobody bleeds like that. That, that looks a little too theatrical to me. I don't know. Let's follow the trail of blood. Oh. Woman on porch. I got her. Ah, babies. Of course, it had to be babies. Let's murder these babies. I guess it could be a period. Some other place shown in photos. What is that? Ah, it's a water wheel, I think. Is that a water wheel? Is that what they call it? I don't know what they call it. Alright, so I'm supposed to take a picture of the water wheel. So there's two versions of these ghosts. There's the nice little navy ghost, and then there's the trying to kill you ghosts. It's the same ghost though. There's several pieces of paper on the floor. Looks like a part of a notebook. Ooh, the black book. September. Uh, Tomoe's condition is getting worse and worse. She can't stop shaking, and she keeps mumbling the same words over and over. I don't know if that's if what's happening is anything supernatural or not. But in, in any case, I think we'd better leave as soon as possible. Tomoe is in such bad shape, she can't even move. I guess I'll have to look for a way out of her ear myself. And if we waited for help, I doubt anyone would ever come looking for us. That's right, just leave her. Save yourself. Okay. Nope. I keep hearing these chimes. <gasps> Crazy Russian doll set. Some other place that shows in the photo. Nope. Alright, let's just follow the blood. For some reason it stops right here. Check out those shadows. Oh yeah. An audio tape. I guess we gotta listen. <gasps> She's looking at something. Wait, what is she looking at? Oh. What do we have here? 
Woman in pain. Yep, that's a woman in pain, alright. Let's, uh, let's have a listen at the item that we just got. It was uh, red tape too, I believe. Yep. September 11, 8.16 p.m. We looked all over the mansion, but we still couldn't find Koji. While true that this mansion is huge, I'm certain we would have found him by now. Could we have already left? He's I don't think so. Something about more robes since we took some photos yesterday. Yeah, that would suck. More ropes, though. Okay, so basically just detailing that uh, their entire, their little group ain't doing so hot. Oh god, another seal. The door is closed fast. And it's broken. Alright, so it's broken. I guess we're gonna do something with those things later on. Oh! I'll follow you in a second. Let me just go check this place out. Nope, because there's nothing there. Ooh, the bondage shrine. That's a good idea. Everything needs a shrine. The shrine of mayonnaise. Why not? Ooh. So we're near a river? I had no idea this mansion was next to a river. Ah, it was nothing. Ah, the cinematic's over. Alright, let's go. Come on, something violent, come on! What is that? Is that the chick? Can't even make her out. My goodies. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep saying that. She's dead, but her head is not... popped out, come on! Oh no! That's kind of a letdown. Ooh, another tape. Let's have a listen. September 12th, 9 a.m. I found Koji. His death was just like the one in the mountain village. His head and limbs were severed. I can't believe what's happening. That's it? Ah, but how come we don't get to see their heads just pop off, man? Come on! I want to see some blood or something, you know? All this, all this just kind of fainting. It's not, not doing it for me. Oh, there we go. Woman pulled in. Ah, that was the other uh, picture I was supposed to, to do. I totally kind of forgot about it. Wow, look at that PS2 water. That is impressive. Oh, you got another one. The garden lantern in the photo is lit. So I'm supposed to light it? Just light it. It isn't lit. So light it. Looks like I can't go f any further. There's something shining on the floor. A stone mirror, okay. Wait, what? Stone mirror? 
You are already carrying the maximum number allowed for this item. Great. So I can't even use them. Okay. I guess I should use them. I guess so. Let's see. Okay, let's let's see what what can we use? What's the best function we can come up with here? Let's see, make ghosts more visible for a limited duration. As that could be good. Paralyze stop movements of ghosts for a certain duration. Search slow pressure push ghosts back. I guess C would make the most sense because I want those zero shots and if I paralyze it's going to take them a long time for them to do the zero shots. Searching for locations of ghosts and tracks them automatically. I think that's really good though. I'll wait. Just a uh, I'll wait for the for the other one. The searching one. That sounds good though. Cuz some of these ghosts are very very slippery. Slippery ghosts. Okay, so what, what was I doing here? Okay, I can't go any further. I opened the door. Yes, okay, so we should go back. I don't remember where that door was, though. Let's go back, then. There was two doors that were locked. I think we can unlock one of them. I think it was this door. Is that the baby door? I think it was the baby. Well, it was the door where I heard the baby cries. Let's, let's go check it out. Baby cries are always a good sign for something. Yes, I believe so. Nope. No, no, I want to miss her. Ah, 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 ah. Woman turning. Posing. Again with the crazy sounds, uh, that's it. Kitty. Kitty. -e. A doll with long hair and a white kimono. It's roped up with sac sacred ropes, worshipped. Oh, well, at least, at least they have a hobby. Everybody needs a hobby. Let's see. There are several pieces of paper. Okay, let's see. Okay, I think her final entry. My sixth sense is telling me some children are playing here. I can't see them, but they keep calling to me. Are they playing tag or hide and seek? Maybe. Okay, they might be the children in that photo. Uh, there were human heads <laughs> in the room. So many of them. They were cut off by the Himura family master. They were all trying to tell me something. Okay, I never should have come here. I should have trusted that sixth sense of mine. Well, if you're going to have a sixth sense, you might as well trust it, you know? Hello, Kunichi. Kunichi, welcome to the stream. Uh, glad for you to make it. This is not a drawing stream. I actually did a drawing stream uh, about an hour ago. I'm going to say an hour and 30 minutes ago. And we did two pictures. You can check them out on my DeviantArt and my Pixiv account. Uh, but right now we're just playing scary games late at night, all alone in the dark. Nope. I want to see these heads that that the note was telling me about. The sliding screen I can't see in the atrium. I like this music in the background. That's nice. Many Japanese dolls on a red mat. They're wearing beautiful kimonos. They look expensive. You better take one. Just take it. I swear there's some something in here though. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. you. Hey, little peeping tom. Oh god, kids. Kids are creepier than anything. I did. Thank you for telling me, Tree. Kids are creepy if they're ghosts or just running around in the street. They're just creepy, alright? Oh, yeah. Crawling children on the floor. Let's do it. 
Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm not. We're doing it. We're doing it now. Let's go. Woo. Yeah, that's right. Get the hell away from me. I ain't got no candy. Leave me alone. Oh. I think I lost him. That's not good. Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay. I just uh, get into a good position here. Let's go. Where you at, ghost? <laughs> zero shot. To one more zero shot and your ass is mine. Not that I want your ass. I'm just saying. Spirit stone. This camera screwing me up here. Hey, there you are. Let's go. Bam! Oh no 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 no! There we go. That is unfair. I took the picture. I took the picture. That is so unfair. Ah, oh, that was not a zero shot. I feel ashamed. I should probably take a little bit of health. Ah, screw you. I'm tired of you, chid. Let's get out of here. Yes, they're trying to get to my sugar lumps. All the ghosts want my sugar lumps. Ah, let's see. My life ain't too bad. I guess I'll take a normal medicine. I got ten. Whoop. There you go. Let's see, maybe now I have enough for the camera to use the thing here. That's a little too expensive. Yeah, why not? Let's just get the bonus shot, I guess. The bonus function. Okay, so Paralyze supposedly is more expensive. Stop moments of ghosts for a certain duration. Yeah, Paralyze is the most expensive, but I think Search is the most useful. Searches for locations of ghosts and tracks them automatically. Hmm, wait a minute. Okay. You either make them visible or you track them. I'm guessing Search is you press the button, R1, and then the camera goes directly to where the ghost is and just tracks them. I guess that's good. I guess that's good. We'll do that. We'll do that. Why not? Enable search? Yes. Disable? No. Alright. We bought it. I think I'm going to stick with that bonus function for now. Uh, and then I'm just going to keep... I'm just going to focus on speed and max value and all that other stuff. That's what's most important. There's a hole here, but it's gone now. No, it's still there, I'm just saying. Alright, so I took a picture of a crazy-ass blue child, and now I gotta go to the other door that was closed, I think. Let's go. Oh. Oh! Uh, bad luck there, Kira. Oh, crap, we got a ghost. This is not a good place to be, because... I need nice open uh, ground to move around here. Let's see. Why don't we give our thing a shot? Why not? Bam. Yep. I have five spirit stones. Oh yeah, come on, come on. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Huh. Yeah, the ability works okay. Bam. I like this ghost because it looks like her neck is broken. Oh, I saw something shiny. Let's go pick up that shiny thing up there. Ah, the spirit stone. So I used it and now I got another one. So hmm. good for me, I guess. Okay, so this door should be open now. Ah, come on, Mr. Talisman, let's go. Man turning. It's Mr. Takamine. Let's go see what he wants. Q. 
Kyrie. Maiden. Okay, yeah. All right. We, we got it. Three things. There's something shiny on the floor. <gasps> a lighter. There's a little bit of oil in what's inside. It uh, has J Takamine engraved on the back. Okay. So now I can light the the little um, lantern that was on the on the shores. And we got a notebook. Let's check it out. Mm, that woman that Tomoe called Kirie looks just like the description of a rope shrine made in the legends. And there is a strong resemblance too between the way Tomoe and Ogata died and the manner of the deaths of the folklore. So that woman is the rope shrine maiden. Is she? Oh, so this ne. Okay, let's check out the map. Okay, this is where I came in. There's a second floor here. Let's go exploring. That's what we're supposed to be doing here. Oh. This door is barred. Barred? Barred off? Oh, shiny. A red notebook strap. The mirror is breaking. Smash. A broken mirror. People on the floor. All over the mansion. So many people. All those people. What are they running from? And then at the end, with such desperate looks on their faces. Something's coming this way from deep within the mansion. A coldness. It's colder than anything I've ever felt. I don't know any more if this is a dream or real. I'm guessing this is like an old, old diary from the people who used to live and work in the mansion. Am I supposed to go here? I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to go to here. Uh, there's so many places I need to go. You know what? Let's let's go back. Let's go light that lighter. Light that lantern. Before I go exploring to other places. But since I'm already here, I might as well go upstairs. <laughs> let's go check it out. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, we got some things up here. Come on. More stuff. Okay, this door is barred. A notebook. The legend of the holy mirrors, the mirrors of the five gods. The holy mirrors held in five shrines in this region are most commonly known as the mirrors of the five gods. The legend tells that the five gods, before leaving the land, created these mirrors as a means of protecting the village. The legends mention another mirror. The story is that all five mirrors were used together in a ritual to fend off a huge disaster. Or this is known as the calamity. Ah, uh, so the calamity is the disaster that happened, and the the mirrors are what's used to to calm it down. It is not known whether the ritual mentioned above is related in any way to the one performed by the immortal family, but there is the recreation of the mirrors. However, the actual existence of the legendary holy mirror, one complete mirror, has not been confirmed, and it is not known that the legend is based on. Okay. So we need a crap ton of mirrors to stop this whole calamity from happening. Why... Why do they have to put this... Uh, the fate of the world kind of storyline and this kind of thing just let it be a story of a girl looking for her brother okay you don't need to involve the entire world she doesn't have to be some sort of superhero that saves everybody this is a small piece of paper in the article okay the girl who has been found after three days of mysterious disappearance has been adopted finally by mr hinasaki a close friend of ryozo munakata also missing we'll adopt the girl Okay. The girl's parents were missing even after she returned, so the police was looking for a foster home or adoptive family. The girl does not remember anything from her disappearance, and the three other children are still missing. So children used in the ritual, I suppose. Okay. I guess we can go down. Let's go down. Yes, Void Stalker Zero. This is in fact Fatal Frame. We are playing Fatal Frame late, late at night, in the dark, completely alone. Except for you guys. Thank you for joining me. The floor at the foot of the staircase has fallen. Okay. What was I gonna do? Ah, yes, I was gonna go and light a lantern. Let's do that. So much backtracking. 
which is fine. I'm tired of games where like just keep pushing you, pushing you through a tube of gameplay that stinks. You know, you gotta you gotta realize where you are, get a lay of the land, and uh, make the right decisions. This is Fatal Frame One, the very first one. It is for the PS2, for the Xbox. Mm, but I'm playing on an emulator because I have no other way of recording the video games. Let's just do it like this. This is the only garden lantern that isn't lit. Let's light that bit up. Da -na 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 -na. I could have sworn the, the Zelda little uh, tinkle is going to work. <gasps> There is something inside the top part of the garden lantern. I don't think that's a very good place to hide secret things. Imagine just some random person like, oh, this lantern's off, let me light it. Holy crap, drugs! <laughs> it's, it's, the, it's the master's stash. A stone with a strange character carved into it. The reverse side has a plug. Okay, so I'm supposed to stick this thing into something. Oh yeah. See, stone mirror. Hmm. I guess I already have that. That's okay. This game, this game ain't that scary. Come on, guys. That's okay. I'm playing this with super cool headphones, super super loud, as hard loud as I can take, and I am pretty much alone in the dark. What time is it? It's 11.12. It's not that late. Oh! The headphones that I'm using are Astro A40s, I believe. Yeah, the A40s are the ones that are... Uh, that have wires attached to them. There was a wireless version, I think it was the A50, but that's okay, I don't care about wireless. What I care about is performance. What the hell was I doing? Um, okay, so we went to the shrine, we lit that thing up, we got a little peg, that thing is closed. Okay, so I need to go back, yes, this is the place I didn't explore, alright, let's, let's go there. Is that a coat hanger? Uh, it looks like a little coat hanger. <laughs> okay, we are in the aqueduct, I suppose. There's something on my feet. Herbal medicine. That's always good to have. And a cutscene. Okay. Hello, Shippe. Welcome to some gameplay. What's going on? Ah, uh, my sugar lumps! All the ghosts want to taste of my sugar lumps. Okay, now I'm gonna fight her. You know what? I have not used any of the special camera film that I've been collecting. Uh, it does not possess high exorcism. It possesses higher exorcismal power. Let's do that. Okay, stop farting at me, game. Okay, let's move back. Let's see what you got. What you got? 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 Ha ha ha! Gotcha. What you got? What you got? What you got? Don't run away. Let's go. Come at me. Let's go. Oh 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 oh. Done. You're done, girl. Get out of here. Ooh. 
Ooh, I got a red tape for my troubles. Let's go switch the the film that I was using. I think I can switch the the film on the fly. I gotta check that out. Oh yeah, let's uh, have a listen. Why not? Let's see what is it? Okay, the red tape four. Let's check it out. Since we met that girl, I've seen many strange visions. All the ghosts in the mansion howl and scream at me. I don't think they'll ever let me out of this mansion. I don't even know how long I can hold on to my sanity. Anyway, I'm leaving this tape. If ever someone listens to this, please tell me what has happened to me. Still, I hope it's just a dream. Life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat. Gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. Is that hair? What is that? Oh no. <laughs> it's just a, a net for catching fish, I guess. There are several pieces of paper on the floor. Let's check it out. Okay, another entry. A little girl in a white kimono keeps pleading to me. I can't keep my mind focused, but her voice rings in my head and won't leave. But what does she want me to do for her? I can't even get out of the mansion anymore. Broken. Five pieces of the mirror. Okay, so find the five pieces of the broken mirror, put them together, and bam, you're out of there. Tell Mr. Takamiya the way to break the curse. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> there are buttons with characters and devices to open. There's an engraver underneath, but the gouge can't read it. Barely look it out. The chosen maiden and purifies from the gouge outwards. The chosen maiden purifies. Oh, for God's sakes. I can't even remember what was the thing. Was it? Okay. So this is one. Three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven, eight, nine. There we go! <laughs> I just remember the number. Three, six, six, nine. I is very smart today. Okay, ooh, we have a safe spot here. Let's check it out. Ah, uh, yeah, a well. Pretty sure nothing is gonna happen there. Nope, no siree. Nothing scary is gonna come out of that well. Probably a couple puppies holding kitty cats. The rope. You belong to the rope now. Ooh, a spirit stone. Which I haven't used very much, but there we go. Uh, yes, let us save. Because why not? Puppies holding kitty cats while wearing little hats. Adorable. Alright, let's get out of here. Yes, let's get back to the game. Let's check out this... Let's check out this well, shall we? I need to... <laughs> it's Bart Simpson. He's trapped. <laughs> He's trapped down on the well. I'm little Timmy O'Toole, and I'm stuck in the well. Okay, there's something red here. Okay, when this thing says it's red, that means there's something evil. If you were in such a hurry, you'd speak a little faster. I'm looking at something. What you looking at? What you looking at? Nope. Bam. 
girl turning. I'm going to save again, because why not? Okay, let's go. Do, 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 just a stroll through the bamboo forest. And a cutscene. Okay. I don't know about you, but those little red petals, that would freak me out already. Like, where are they coming from? There's nothing red around here. What? Oh, crap! Oh, it's the chick again. She just won't quit. She wants a taste of my sugar lumps. I'm missing. I'm missing. That's not good. Come on. No, I'm a... Oh, I can't go back anymore. That's not good. That's not good. <laughs> Let's get out of here. No, my goodies. Let's get out of here. All right, come on, let's go. Oh, oh. well, that's not fair. All right, girl, you want to play hardball? Let's play hardball. Yeah, let's stop off there. Tracking super tracker. Okay. This girl was not that hard before. I am not gonna die to this chick. So I think I, I think I got the pattern down. Huh? Let's go, let's go. Ah. Ah, you bee. You bee. I totally took pictures of you. Oh, you're not screwed. We're doing it old school. We're doing it old school. Oh, what the hell? Oh, my camera's going nuts. My camera's going nuts. I can't see. What's going on here? Come on, you ain't that tough. Let's go. Bam. I don't know what just happened. That That was just I was I was doing all the wrong things. Yes, yes, the mirror. I get it. You're very pretty. Let's continue. Let's just save. Well, at the very least, I actually used some of the herbs I was collecting. You know, don't want the game to think I'm not taking this seriously. Let us continue our adventures through the bamboo forest. Oh, wait, is that shiny? Yeah, oh yeah, my eyes do not deceive me, that is shiny. A stone mirror. I actually used it, didn't I? Okay, so the stone mirror is not the item then. Sacred water. 
Stone mirror. Spirit stone. Okay, a polish mirror like uh, protect the spells. Yeah. Can I be used here? Don't fart at me, game, please. Let's try to keep you civilized. I think it's in the special functions. No disable, that's not good. Hmm. What the hell are those, those things used for? I think. I think they are lives. Yes, I think that's what they are. If I die, then this, that stone like smashes and then I get revived. I think that's what it is. Let me check the description one more time. A polished mirror-like stone, a protective spirit dwells inside. Yes, I, I think that's what it is. I think that's what it is. Hmm. Okay, so it's basically a navy in a bottle. Shiny. Pick up the shiny. Black notebook. In the materials, Tomoe gathered for me, there's a paragraph about five pieces of mirror passed down through the Kimura family of generations. Those pieces were set to seal off the Hellgate. Hmm and protect the region from a great disaster. They might have something to do with the current hellish situation. <laughs> the Hellgate and the hellish situation. They might have something to do with each other. Uh, five holy mirrors and shrines around the area all broke in a small earthquake the other day. When I heard about it, it gave me the idea for the next work of mine. I think I brought a news article about it with me when I came here. It says there were only five holy mirrors in existence. But according to some legends, there is another, the true holy mirror. The folklore also mentions this is the research documents. The ones I found here in the mansion, I think I dropped the research documents somewhere when I was here. It's the curse woman, uh huh. Here are my theories. I think that the five mirrors that were destroyed in the earthquakes the other day had the role of watching over the true holy mirror. I don't think it was the earthquake that broke the five holy mirrors in the shrine. I think it was a signal that the seal of the hell gate that Kimono true. Holy Mirror provides, 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 had broken for some reason. The five mirrors were trying to warn us. Okay. So it's five mirrors surrounding one super mirror, and that super mirror is lost, and I need to find it. Maybe the super mirror is inside the camera? Mm, it's possible. Thank you, Tree, for uh, googling that for me. Piece of fun. Okay, let's see. Oh, oh God! Look at those textures. Oh, oh my eyes, my my PC elitist eyes. I can't take it. It's scarier than the ghosts. But it's PS2. I'll I'll give I'll I'll give some slack. Oh, there she is. Kirie, that's her name? Kirie. Let's go check that place out. Yeah, it's the only place to go. Uh, something tells me there's going to be a boss fight here. Oh. Standing man. The rope made in curse. It's just. I mean, just touch your ball. Your glowy ball. You need to finish your sentences, man. Come on. It's like when you're gonna die, you're like, uh, just remember one last super important thing. Don't you ever. Yeah, he could have just said that thing first, and then say it was super important. You don't have to give an entire speech when you're going to do that. Let's see, something's reflecting. Ooh, a stone mirror! Some more ammo for something that I'm not even using. Ah, great. Pick it up. Some Type 37 film, which I have. Ooh, invisible walls. Oh yeah, this is nice. 
This is real nice. Good work, developers. You can just put a bunch of boxes there. <laughs> I mean, boxes stop her from moving anywhere. Just put some boxes in there. You know, make it look at least a little bit believable. Let's see, am I ready for this? I think there's a boss fight in here. Let's let's do that. Let's switch here. Uh, let's get all decked out and get my makeup ready. Here we go. Oh god, it reacted. Do I match the carvings to the characters? Maybe. Okay, so I gotta put those things in the right order. Okay. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Okay, I'll move this here, move that there, move that there, and then move this here. Yay! In we go. Is that blood? Oh, that's blood, alright. That's a lot of blood. What's making all that blood? Something's tripping. I guess the roof's having its period. Shark week. Let's go. There's a mirror here. There's a big mirror at the shrine. I wonder if it means anything special. Well, all this talk about mirrors, I'm pretty sure every single mirror has some sort of importance to it. Okay, there's nothing else in here. I'm going to touch this thing. It, it better not be like Indiana Jones as soon as I touch this thing. just Everything just goes crazy. Let's go. Oh, an audio tape. There are four Buddha statues and some kind of pedestal in front of a small shrine. What? What's going on? Crucified man. My goodies! Oh man, that guy is having the time of his life. Death by Snoo Snoo. Okay. Alright, so this is a boss fight. Come on. Come on, Mr. Takamine. Show me what you got. Psychomantis. You like to play Castlevania. Oh, crap! <laughs> Oh, that is so unfair. Can I get out of here? Let's get out of here. Screw you, buddy. I'm out of here. You can have your damn shrine. I'm getting out of here. Alright, fine. I'll fight you. I'm just gonna lame it out. I don't want the same thing to happen. The last time. Oh, it's gonna take forever. Come on, Mr. Takamine, let's go. Let's go, what you got? What you got there, boys? Oh, I'm blind! I'm blind! Oh, God! I can't see nothing! I can't see nothing! I'm blinded! Oh, crap! What's going on here? <laughs> did I actually hit him with a zero shot? I think I did, because they lowered his... his a health, but quite a lot though. Screw you, Mr. Takamine! Some Shinto gate somewhere shows in the picture. Yeah, that's right. What you got? You got nothing, that's what. Soru Kurekto! Alright, so I gotta look for the for the Buddha statue, I guess. Alright, let's just switch the film, I suppose. Yep, to the cheapo film. Still don't have enough of that. Yeah, I'm gonna wait until the range is super, super powerful. 
It's a notebook. Torn asunder. Let's see. I'm about to go to the shrine deep within Himura Mansion, where they say a piece of the true holy mirror is kept. The curse has already left its mark on my four limbs. There's no escaping it. But the only thing left now that I can do is try to reseal the Hellgate. It's my last hope. I've already found four of the Buddha statues. I need to get a piece of the mirror. And I've managed to find an old document that tells of the location of the fifth statue. Make observance to the Buddha at the base of the large gate so that the souls of the petuous maidens can reach up to the heavens. If all goes well, no one will ever have to read these notes, and I can use them towards the content of my next book. Yay! In closing, I would like to thank my, thank my assistant and my partner, Tomoe Hirasaka. He's dead. If it weren't from the words she left with me, I wouldn't have been able to complete this. My final work, if I don't return, please give her a decent burial. Signed, Jinsei Takamine. Well, they're all dead, bro, so good luck. Nope, there's still something here. Yes, I know, I'm supposed to put another Buddha statue in here. Don't be so impatient. The blood gone? The blood's gone! What the hell? So it was ghost blood, huh? That's what it was. Okay, so I'm supposed to look for another Buddha statue. I'm hearing crazy sounds again. But where? I. I At the base of the shrine? Here? Is it here? There's nothing here. What the hell? <laughs> it's just some random bird. Screw you, bird. I'm dealing with ghosts right now. Jeez. I hear something. Oh, I didn't even notice. My health is really, really low. Let's fix that. Power up. Pressing all the wrong buttons, let's go. Okay. I'm hearing these scratchy, scratchy noises. But I don't know from where, though. Oh, 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 oh! Somewhere here. Oh, there we go, there we go. What you got? Warped man, it's pretty warped. That was it. There's something, there's nothing at the base of the Shinto gate. Could it be somewhere else? I was just pressing randomly. Ah, there it is! There's a hidden door at the base. I'm so glad I didn't just backtrack everywhere. That would have been embarrassing. Headless Buddha. The head is damaged and painted in red like blood. Five Buddhas document. Uh, bury the rope maiden's spirit. Place the five Buddhas with her damaged limbs. Okay. Interesting. A row of four Buddhas, there's space for another in the middle. Yes, put that thing in there. Put the Buddha statue with the damaged head between the four Buddha statues. The pedestal open and reveal three, three grid of holes. The little Buddha statues appears above the row of the holes of the pedestal. Okay. Ah, uh, beautiful, another puzzle. I guess I'm just supposed to arrange them based on how they. what's missing, I guess? Doesn't seem too hard. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<gasps> I heard a soft sound. I think it's unlocked. Yes, you heard right. Is this the holy mirror? It's just a piece of it. Great. What the? I was staring at this piece of mirror for like five hours. I didn't even notice. Oh. She's there, but she's not there, if you know what I mean. Oh no, she's in the mirror, not in my place. That's. Oh, how clever. It's been done. Still looks nice. So is she like the original uh, shrine maiden? Like the first ever chick to do that? The hell is that thing? Bunch of body parts. And limbs. Oh crap! <laughs> oh man. Okay, hang on a minute. No, no, no. Well, that was not fair. This game just keeps doing unfair things. I think I've been cursed and I have seven days. And then children have danced around me to complete the ritual. <laughs> oh, this is... No, stop it. Damn kids. Yep, you're screwed. You're basically screwed. The rope? No. Ah, they should have left the marks there. It would have been more impressive. I guess that's it. That's the f that's one chapter. Yes, finish saving. Okay, guys. I think we're going to call that the night. The night is still very young, but uh I don't think I have the mental fortality to keep doing this for another 2 hours. So I think we're going to call that a night. I hope everybody who came to my stream enjoyed it. Uh, I would like to do this again some other night. It has to be a night. It can't be in the middle of the day or anything like that. Unfortunately, I have to wake up super early in the morning sometimes. So I can't really do this at night every single night. So hopefully Saturdays would be a fatal frame night, I guess. At the very least until I uh, finish this thing. So... I hope you guys are enjoying the game. We, we will continue this next uh, stream. And uh, this gameplay will be on YouTube. Hopefully nothing bad will happen because of it. So let's see. Thank you so much, guys. And I'll catch you guys later, okay? Bye.